Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. So today I posted a video of my husband making carbonara. A lot of you asked how to make it, super easy. So I'm gonna show you guys how he makes it. I'm just gonna do the filming. Oh, you're gonna need some cheese, double cream, pasta, some smoked diced lardon. It's actually better if you get smoked and some egg. So the cheese we're using is mature cheddar and it is 350 grams and we're going to use three quarters of this and grate it. That's all our grated cheese. We're putting these to fry. The next step is to add your fresh double cream to the lardons. This is how many ml? This is 600 ml and we've put half in. And you just put it straight in the pan with the lardons. Next thing you want to do is take three eggs, separate out the yolks and that's what we're going to put um, in the pasta last minute and it just like, like the best thing ever. Okay, he's already put all the rest of the double cream and we've put half of the cheese that we grated earlier on. It's making it extra creamy. When the um, cheese is melted you can put the rest of the cheese so it doesn't go like lumpy or anything. And now we're pouring all the sauce in. Oh no, oh no. So now we're opening another like pot of double cream and we're just gonna quickly like fry that like quickly. This is the best angle ever. But anyways, I don't know if I've already said this, but this recipe is very quick and easy and it's really like not messy as well. Like I've already cleaned everything up, it's not messy and it takes like what, 30 minutes to make? The rest of the cream in. Then you want to put the uh, yolks in quickly. Mix it all up. When I tell you this is so yummy, you can also you can always substitute the pork for chicken if you don't eat pork. So uh, this is the final result guys it's so yum it's just real hearty food i mean i know this is always good so i'm not like oh i don't know how this is gonna taste <laughs> what do you guys think of my hair like olaplex is like my best friend like it really like made my hair super healthy even though it got bleach i get asked this question a lot like how many times did i bleach my hair i actually bleached it only once um it was done by troy hair i know i'll get asked this a lot so he'll be tagged in the info box guys just made this and then thank me later or just thank my hubby later because he just makes it so good I'm not even lying, that's like a 10 out of 10 for me. Anyways, everyone's gonna eat now. I'm gonna watch a bit of Netflix. Also, definitely recommend Peaky Blinders. I was obsessed, but I finished it all. So now I've moved on to Atypical because there's a new season. That's come out, and also The Crown's coming out. I'm not sure if it's come out already, but I need to like watch that ASAP. I don't know, I'm just obsessed with my hair. There's a bit of ginger underneath where I had a bit of box dye left. It's weird, but. Guys, look at that. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Alright, guys, thanks so much for watching this quick video. Um, I when I shared it on my Instagram, a lot of you asked for me to film it for my channel. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It really, really makes a difference. And yeah, love you lots, and I'll see you in my next one.